Speaking of national security, Trump is still concerned with our southern border in response to a surge of migrants coming into this country. Today, Trump unveiled a new approach that treats asylum seekers fairly and humanely. April Fools. I gotcha. I gotcha. I gotcha. Say terrible. Just terrible. No. I love pranks. I love pranks. No. In fact, Trump threatened to shut the Mexico border just in time for spring break. Hey, college kids. I know you had your heart set on Cancun, but how about spring break wall? <laughs> Show us your slats. Now, Trump... Trump announced his threat to, in an epic three-part policy tweet. The Democrats have given us the weakest immigration laws anywhere in the world. Mexico has the strongest, and they make more than $100 billion a year on the U.S. Therefore, Congress must change our weak immigration laws now, and Mexico must stop illegals from entering the U.S. Dot, 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 through their country and our southern border. Mexico has, for many years, made a fortune off the U.S. far greater than border costs. If Mexico doesn't immediately stop all illegal immigration coming into the United States thrug our southern border. <laughs> I will be closing that, 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 that. That is... It's a lot of words to get thrug. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, dig down. Fin finish, finish strong, Colbert. Here we go. That, 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 that. <laughs> the border or large sections of the border next week, this would be so easy for Mexico to do, but they just take our money and talk. <laughs> talk? What is that? I don't... Why would he say what talk? They don't, yeah, don't I assume don't talk was in quotes because Trump doesn't know Spanish as a real language. <laughs> what are they... What, I'm sorry, what are they gibbering over there? <laughs> Sounds like someone is shouting menu items from Taco Bell at me. Hold on. <laughs> Let me try. Hola, a chalupa gordito to you. <laughs> and many happy crunch wrap. <laughs> crunch wrap supremes. He finished up. Thank you. Oh. Tell. 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 Mm. Thank you very much. He finished up. Besides, we lose so much money with them, especially when you add in drug trafficking, etc. Period. Random close parentheses, <laughs> comma, that the border closing would be a good thing. No, it would not. Closing the border would not be a good thing. According to the U.S. Chamber of Commerce, the U.S. and Mexico trade about $1.7 billion in goods daily, and the decision would threaten 5 million American jobs, which is why they called it an unmitigated economic debacle. <laughs> to which Trump said, thanks so much. I've always said America's economy has too much buckle. <laughs> it is our job to de- Buckle it. <laughs> but even worse, even worse. See, fans. Finally, yeah. Finally, an audience willing to see the president side of these things. <laughs> even worse, experts say, if imports from Mexico were stopped today, Americans would run out of avocados in three weeks. <laughs> Holy lack of guacamole. <laughs> no avocados. What are we supposed to put in our toast now? <laughs> Jelly? <laughs> you go to Concord Grape Hell, old man. <laughs> but Trump doesn't believe so called experts with their so called facts talking. 
At a rally in Michigan last week, he told the crowd the move would actually be good for the economy. And I don't know if you know it or not, Michigan, but Mexico took about 30 percent of your car business. If we close the border, that means we're not taking those cars into our country. And what does that mean? That means you're going to make more cars right here in the good old USA. That's right. No imported cars or exported cars will shut ourselves off from the world, just like North Korea. Get ready for the exciting new 2019 Pontiac ox cart. <laughs> now, a lot of these asylum seekers uh, come from uh, Central American countries further south. So to punish those countries, Trump has officially taken steps to cut off aid to Guatemala, Honduras, and El Salvador. Or, as was reported by Fox News, Trump cuts U.S. aid to three Mexican countries. <laughs> That's right. Well, now we know why Mexico didn't pay for the wall. <laughs> Trump only asked one of the Mexicos. <laughs> I'm sure the other two would chip in, cut the cost. <laughs> now, that's true. <laughs> they could, they maybe, might. Maybe, maybe. Who knows? I look forward to future Fox News graphics like thousands of Mexicans march in Puerto Rico Day Parade. <laughs> Running of the bulls today in Euro Mexico <laughs> and warning sign placed on floor Mexico. <laughs> we got a great show for you tonight. Nathan Lane is here. But when we return, Joe Biden. Joe Biden. Stick around.